painting peeps and welcome it's Kathleen from cause creations welcome to the no bra zone I spent about an hour trying to adjust my lights and whatnot I really want to do a nice black canvas and I hope the glare isn't too bad because these colors sometimes get washed out by these white lights. I pointed them up towards the ceiling and I turned off all the lights around me. So I'm kind of working here a little bit in the dark. I sure hope you can see this all right. And I also hope you all are well and staying busy. Our canvas today, I don't know what size it is. I accidentally, I think it's like an... 15 by 30 and our base coat today is unicorn spit and it is the midnight blackness because i am trying so hard to find a black black that stays black after it dries so i'll let you know how this does after it does dry but that's mixed with my pouring medium, which is 75% Floetrol mixed with 25% GAC 800. So I put my Floetrol in my container up to 25% and I strain it. And then I add about 25% more GAC 800. I stir it up real good before I use it. And I stir it up every time I use it because the Floetrol is heavier and it tends to sink to the bottom. So a lot of people ask me questions about that. Our colors today are Chroma Molten Metal Acrylics. This is the Emerald Green. And this is yummy. Very, very, very pretty. Our next color today is Chroma Molten Metals, and this is the Plum Purple. Also a very, very pretty color. And our third and final color today is this lovely silver. You can see how it drips very nicely off my popsicle stick and leaves very little mound. I like my paints kind of fluid, guys. They just work best for me, and you all need to experiment to find your own way with that, as I did. That silver is a combination of the Chroma Molten Metal Pergair Silver and Golden Iridescent Silver. Just a squirt or two of this. The golden uh, paints are very high pigmented, and you don't need a lot. So I'm going to go ahead and get everything ready for us. I think I'm going to do a swipe. I haven't quite decided yet. And I'm not sure if I'm going to use my flexible plastic, which is just um, a plastic cover from a report cover that I cut into different pieces and different sizes to get different widths, or I might use a damp paper towel. I'm gonna noodle over that, guys, because that's what I do. <laughs> I hope you guys are well. I hope you guys are making do and staying busy. We've been gardening and painting walls and cleaning baseboards, and just every day we find something to kind of add some normalcy to our lives and I'm wishing the same for you all. Thanks for being here guys. I'm gonna put some music on, do a little noodling and then we're gonna get busy.